Welcome to Philadelphia Christian Church, a church of brotherly love and a church that worships in spirit and in the truth. These are your announcements. It's a regular week here at Philadelphia with Monday through Friday noonday prayer. Stop in for your lunch break. Tuesday Bible study will be at 7 p.m. Join us if you missed last Bible study. Go to pccsermons.com to get it. Thursday school of prayer at 6.15 and then the fire ministry at 7 p.m. on Thursday night. Today is the playoffs for the Men's Hebrew Softball League starting at 4 p.m. today in Broussard at Arsenal Park. Now, right now, here is a message from Pastor Omar. You don't trust me. You just know you can't bring your bag in. You just know they got one thing that I done decided on that you don't like. So you amplify my perceived and your perception. And you break ties. You see? It's unreasonable. We got a deep embedded prejudice against one another. We do. Cause you ain't doing that in the airport. You ain't doing that when they when they checking your bag someplace else. You ain't doing that at the mother church. You ain't doing that, but you come here and you wanna do that, Negro. Please listen. Look, look. Playtime is over with. We ain't putting up with that pressure. You gonna treat us like you treat them people. That's off the top. You gonna treat. Take your bag off. Go put it in the car. Cause what you don't know is is that from a security perspective, we understand that if they get a weapon that size of your bag in this place, we will be lucky if two people get out of here alive. You understand what I'm saying? But you don't know. You ain't never saw one of them things. I can show it to you. You ain't never saw one of them things before. You never been on the other side of one of them things before. All you know is you can't get your person that matches your shoes and your outfit won't look as fly. The size of that bag brings a weapon in here that can take limbs off of people. But you don't understand. And you look at me and you look at our team and our leadership and over one perceived fault you amplify and you want to break in. It's unfair, it's unrealistic, it's prejudiced, because you would never do that with them people. Listen to me, man. If God is here, and you're hearing the voice of God in here, I don't care if them people in the front say you can't come in here with shoes on. If God is in here, guess what I'm going to do at that door? I'm going to take off my shoes, and I'm going to walk up in there. Because let me tell you something about God's presence. Because you see, if Moses would have been easily offended like y'all, when God told him, Moses, take off your shoes because the place where I stand is holy ground, Moses would have missed his calling. Moses would have missed it. Oh, no, God. Oh, no, God. I can't, I can't bring my shoes in here. I can't bring my purse in here. He would have missed his calling. Y'all better stop being so easily offended. choir is now opening up for more worshipers for musicians and also we are starting a men's choir so we are so excited about this and we want to see you if you are gifted in singing if you can play a guitar if you can play uh, 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 drums if you can play keyboard or whatever instrument I'm looking forward to seeing you so that you can use your gift for the kingdom of God look it's gonna be August 25th at 10 a.m. We will be having a meeting for those who are interested in being part of the worship team. Come on and worship with us. Now, you ready, Jay? Philly family, let's give a special congratulations and a happy anniversary to the Charles family celebrating four years of marriage. Happy anniversary. 
Y'all check this out, Philly. Saturday, J Malvo was able to be a part of the second annual Maestro Day community event in Washington, Louisiana. Bringing some music ministry with But God, 180 Pivot, and We the People. We won Souls to the Kingdom and won first place out of three artists for the talent show. PMG, bringing light in a dark place, shines the brightest. If you have some good news to share, tell us by sending it to phillyoffice1 at yahoo.com. That's phillyoffice1 at yahoo.com. Those were your announcements saying stand to your feet right now. It's worship time.